god. Oh, oh god, that's not what I want. No, get me to the right one. Oh. Get me to oh the god. right one. There we if go. If we're gods, we're gonna need new art. We're gonna have to be blue. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hi everyone, welcome back for another session of Light of Thylea. Thank you for the patience. We know that it's been a couple of weeks, but shit has happened. I am sick today, so my voice is going to be a little bit whatever. Uh, uh, I'll 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 move the mic closer and closer as the evening gets there. I think that's probably what's going to have to happen here. Um, but that aside, I am super excited to delve back in. Session one hundred. You know, okay. it's been. I don't know what's happening. Oh, you're, you're cutting, cutting, you're cutting off. You're oh, you now know what back. happened is. Oh, you got real quiet, and then it was real weird, and I thought maybe I was having a stroke. Can you hear me now? <laughs> you would be. Yeah. Good. Okay. Yeah. I think what happened was I moved the mic and it j jostled the cable just right or wrong, mm. uh, and it's like, nope, nope, you didn't want to talk, right? You're done. Cool. Cool. Thanks. I was like, oh, this is the end. This I, is the I'm end. dying. This is, the end this, <laughs> this is how it ends. <laughs> The voices just make finally disappear. This is therapy all along. Um, with that, though, I think as far as nerd news goes, is there anything that you all have to or want to uh, throw out? Um, Not even mod support for Baldur's Gate to... 3 on, on consoles now, finally? Sorry, Tyler, go ahead. Um, it actually sucks, so let's oh. not talk about that. <laughs> Aww, what's going on with it? Uh, it uh, breaks the game in worse ways, and it's easier to just use uh, outside mods and not uh, go to patch 7, so. Larry, fix your shit. I want to be able to do GM mode inside of Baldur's Gate 3 without consequences, damn it. Um, if you download the level curve mod that lets you level up past 12, you can't use wild shapes as a druid. That's how broken Ooh, it is with the internal mods. Interesting. Yeah, they probably don't communicate well. Okay. It's almost like Foundry now. All right, with that, <laughs> we, are, we are going to delve back in. Actually, uh, speaking of Foundry, there is their Kickstarter called Ember is wrapping up. So if you haven't checked it out, Ember is going to be a lot of different things. Setting, pseudo system, updates to Foundry, big old hex crawl world within which you can operate. Uh, uh, and it, it's supposed to like it's designed to be like a three plus year campaign if you run it for your for your players. Um, obviously, nobody in this chat knows what that's like. Uh, with that though, um, it is something that is interesting to watch. I'm excited to see how it's going to go. And if you want to keep you know supporting Foundry, this is not brought to you by Foundry. Um, then absolutely um, see if you want to back it. With that, then to preserve my voice a little bit, let it fill you. What happened last time? <laughs> This is also going to be a bit of a quiz. I am keenly, keenly interested to see how much the players are actually going to remember what happened three weeks ago. It'll be, it'll be fun. It's been like a month. It's been do like this. a month. I could do this. I could do this. What are their names? You have to get all the names accurate. Oh, cool. Everyone okay. on, on the map oh, right now. Oh, name okay, them. okay. <laughs> so we have Celeste mm. or the Moon Maiden. Mm. Nice, nice. We have, we have Trickster. Sweet. Don't remember his fucking name. We just. I think that. he doesn't have one. It's just. No, he, well, I, think. I, thought he I suggested calling one. him Pan because we're yeah. sticking with the whole ripping off yeah. the entire Greek. Concept. But he um, didn't give us a new name. This is Carpathos. This is mm. Hephaestus. This is Leto. Hi. Your mom, Daphne's Jared mom. Red Leto. Yep. Yep. We have. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> we have Phyla <laughs> and the Light of Phylia. <laughs> Uh -huh. What are our names? What are oh, our names? Don't look, don't Daphne, don't Lyra. <laughs> Lyra, not Lyra. Lyra. Wow. <laughs> All right, um, I kill myself. And, and then this is this new guy with the blonde hair. He was the brain in the jar. He was a, and I, God knows I don't remember his name, but now he's not a brain you in the jar. His name is literally the closest to an actual Greek god. It doesn't mean anything to me. I don't <laughs> uh, Actually, he wasn't a god in Greek myth. Just a just a person. Yeah, so he's he's blonde. I thought he was a demigod. Okay, well, anyways. And we found out that he and Carpathos were lovers at some point. No, hey, they one were did write the other, wow. but not in that. I'm story. sorry. 
Are you what writing fan you been... fiction while you're telling yeah, us what, are... what happened? Let's have stop. you been writing I knew the fourth way? They were fourth... bonded, they were bonded in some way. They were bonded in some way. That the... He was his writer. Okay? Take writer how you will. All hey. right? Elena, I hey. was totally getting those vibes between Helen, Narcissus, and Carpathos. I get it. It was yeah, like, a little questionable. We, we found out <laughs> Queen Helen's dead. Carpathos said, you need to be put down. And he killed his daughter. Um, and... Basically, the fates revealed that the ulterior motive was to release Kente Mane so that we could end him once and for all because he was an abusive ass towards Thylea. So that caused a lot of fighting. Um, basically, the only reason why Yanni and Brissa are even entertaining this plan is because Thylea said she has the ability to bring back all the people that die. But she has the ability. She has not confirmed whether she will or not. She just says, said, I could do it if I wanted to. Um, I had a There's chance There's an implied to... willingness, but yeah. it was not explicit. Yes. Uh, I had the chance today. to go with... It's Thalia Brat. <laughs> yeah. Um, I had the chance to go with the Moon Maiden. Gotta go. I gotta To go leave. <laughs> look at the uh, nice thousand-headed dragon creature. So I got some good information. But the Moon Maiden lost her R. Oops. So that kind of happened. But basically it was just a big like, hey, this is all the information. So we're all on the same page. And now we're going to make people gods. Oh, my gods. Um, yeah. th there's maybe a little asterisk that was kind of like percolating that I'll just add. I'll just add because that was phenomenal, yeah. Elena. Thank you. You know what? I absolutely, if I could get you a god spot in real life, I would, I would just send it on over. Thank um, you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. Um, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> no, I don't think Elena needs to be a god. No. <laughs> We'd be very exhausting. Fucked. She just plays Sims with, with all of us 24-7. I, w I uh, would just be like, that sounds like a you problem. Please leave me alone. <laughs> Elena absolutely was the Sims player who put their Sim in the pool and then deleted the ladders was. and let them drown. Was. What do you mean, was? Mm -hmm. I still play Sims. <laughs> oh, I didn't know people still played Sims. Mm. Do you have those? There's do you have those like underground reverse harem bunkers for your husbands? No, that's a lot of work. More than like four people in a household is just too much work. So, <laughs> not if you just contain them to one room for the rest of their life. You're right. You're it's right. true. See, Especially if that toxic masculinity over here. That's what I should have been doing the whole time. <laughs> oh my god. Alrighty. Um, the one thing that I will throw out there as well is Carpathos. Um, again very much standing on his side of view of things you know was very mean to you all uh pretty much calling out that from his perspective that he played you all and mm. he is opposed oh, right. to the ascension um he has indicated that he would want to carry the god killer weapons that you had promised to the moon maiden and then hopefully use it in the future because Leto, Daphne's mom, is now also afflicted with the same curse that he was, is. And... Oh, right. That's I forgot right. about that part. I thought yeah. if I didn't talk about it, it wouldn't have been canon. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not, it's not it doesn't exist anywhere. Um, oh, wait, the Moon Maiden also. is in the demi plane right now with those items. We have yeah, done that. She, yeah, she left because she got her arm bit off. Yes. Just like, bye, and she went <laughs> in the demi plane. That's right. Mm -hmm. Um,. But anyway, so he pointed out that he'd be willing to guard the divine artifacts with Leto or anyone else that would want to join this death guard of theirs in perpetuity thereafter because he doesn't want to see more gods being made. Um, and kind of like does the whole like, well, look at all this shit. Do you guys want more of this uh, kind of logic with it? We're pack picking back up, I would say, a good half hour after this altercation occurred. <laughs> occurred. <laughs> you all have had time to simmer down. Leto kind of explained to you, Daphne, that she tried to fight against Helen, but the woman overpowered her between magic and supernatural strength and speed. There wasn't much she could do. It seems that Helen's plan had been to try to enslave your mother's mind and send her against you as an extra fuck you. And Carpathos 
with the help of Hephaestus, ended up stepping in and prevented that from happening. Carpathos used his powers and certain knowledge to destroy Helen forever. Leto has been kind of trying to reel. I mean, she is reeling, but she's been trying to reel in all of the facts and try to wrap her head around it. Hephaestus, singular eye, has the biggest circle underneath it you've ever seen. He looks positively exhausted. Mechanically, he's currently at four levels of exhaustion. Oh, and God. for a god, six levels is just as deadly as it is for you. He should be sleeping. <laughs> Despite that, he did for a minute, and then he kind of woke up. He just saw you. He smiled. He put his arms around you and Leto as the... The two of you are sitting on his lap currently, which is like... We well, mm. can maybe yeah. <laughs> not All right. belabor that image too much. There's somebody who's not what's gonna about right now. Their chat. Um, but over yonder, you see Carpathos currently talking with the vile trickster. And what seems to be... Sorry, Pan. What seems to be a little bit of a... What started out as a terse conversation, but it seems that the Vile Trickster was able to break the ice a little bit, and Carpathos has actually smiled, well, half smiled once during this conversation now. Over on the edge of this entire plaza, you see Narciss looking down upon the city of Mitros. His shoulders broad, well-built, but slumped. He kind of just gets down on his knees and then sits crisscross applesauce. And you can tell how the experience of looking down upon Mitros is just weighing down upon him. Light of Thylea, what have you been doing? Isn't this So this is D&D. Uh, you can do pretty much anything <laughs> oh, you yeah. want to. <laughs> I don't you remember don't how to play. Time. I'll point to Lyra and I'll not point to Lyra. I I look at Lyra and I point to the new blonde guy and I go, isn't he like the dragon's brother? No, he's also a dragon. Yeah, but like, wouldn't the five want to see him? Isn't he important to the five? Oh. Yeah. But shouldn't we tell them that he's here? Like a family reunion? You, uh, you got a way to do that? Yanni, <laughs> oh, personal messenger boy. Oh, wow. messenger boy. Yeah. Oh, wow. The first no, thing Yanni does when he comes to No, 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 no. Wait. Send if Rachel's is right down there, can't we? Can't Brissa? Do you... Should we Brissa fly can't down? Do it. Wait, I can fly. Are Are they in Beach? As far as you know, guys, you I'll know be they back. Have been, they have been coordinating. Uh, um, oh yeah, they're busy. The... Yeah, we asked them to come, and they were like, "We're That's helping right. defend the That's... city right you now." You know yeah. what? You would think I'd remember that after a half hour, but I just feel like it was a lot to take in. <laughs> it's almost like we've been in stasis for like three weeks. I'm gonna roll just, it back. Just soaking in our thoughts. I'm gonna roll it, and... roll it right back. So uh, they can have their reunion when everything's dead. We're good. We're good. <laughs> Yeah, it, 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 they'll be fine afterwards, you know. And we, there'll yeah. be much time to celebrate once we, once we win. Yeah, and I'm so sorry. I genuinely forgot I have wings now. That like I did <laughs> forgot that yeah. I could fly. <laughs> they, they, they are brand new, so it's fair. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure if I did the math, they're 24 hours old. <laughs> like this is how new they are. You're they're like not old enough to drink. Bird, like yeah. yeah. It's weird. I, I I picked up on a real grid really quick. <laughs> so. oh. Bet you had trouble Aaron, sleeping. What's right. going on? You know, you <laughs> I'm only this. good with seeing. I'm not good with speaking. We know this. Did you drink some of the ambrosia when I, I wasn't did. looking? I did. I did. Actively like later. sipping on a straw. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long day, week, oh, right. maybe I even a year. All right. So. Um, <laughs> Definitely got way too excited about that. Right. No, I, I remember right. I'm drunk. So lucid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. So, I like Jesus. 
he's a family member, he said I should probably go talk to him. But like the emotional labor of bridging like the gap between all my family members is just yeah, you can't take that on. Exactly. That's a lot. Yeah. That's a lot. You guys need theratry. Yeah. Some more theratry would be really nice, wouldn't it? I mean, I look around, is there a tree nearby? <laughs> yeah. yeah, there are plenty of trees here. Daffy, if talking to trees is what works for you, there Dude, is a... I think a... you forgot that you confessed this to me. You know what? You're right. That's another yeah. thing that happened. <laughs> 30 minutes to go. You are so right. Mm -hmm. um, the last two that. days have just been crazy. Yeah. About that. We probably all uh, have a concussion. Group concussion. <laughs> Welcome to the NFL. <laughs> did, did it... Before you knew it was me, did it help? I really want to lie, <laughs> but like it kind of did. Okay, so oh. so w now we're fate sisters in a poly. No, maybe not sisters because we're like we're poly. So like, but like you can come. Like now you you would talk to me about it, but before you weren't gonna talk to me about it. And and Thylea knew that I was probably the best one to talk to you about it. And like. It went well, but now we don't need a tree. Like, you can just talk to me. I could talk to you. Mm hmm I was, I was just joking about the there tree. I don't think we have time for that. No, we don't. We really don't. <laughs> well, actually, speaking of what we do and don't have time for, um, how are we going to turn any one of us into gods? Man, if I could give you another damn inspiration for doing an awesome job as a player, takes you bring it to the point of the entire let me session. Just, let me just I would bring it back. Players, Awkward players, pivot. Random person <laughs> watching this, take notes. That was very much so a creating a problem so you could solve the problem. That's not yeah, yeah, yeah. DM inspiration. That is the trick. Really. That is uh, the trick. Uh, yeah, I, I'm trying to get out of this. You can't railroad and then put us back on track and take uh, ownership for it. Listen, that's I'm not how that works. Let's give it away from this DMing. problem <laughs> and bring it back to the real problem of how... Are we all on the same page that we're going to kick Kentamani's ass or at least attempt to? I thought that was the plan for... Yeah. Okay. Because literally we don't have a choice otherwise. Okay. Well, I mean, we do just lay down it's and just die. A not good choice. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we need to become. Well, let's do something that puts us on the same playing field. Yana, uh, do you have the spell? I know you were working on that with my shit ex fling. <laughs> hey, look, another blonde dragon. <laughs> They're not. That's true. Not That's, true. Like that, That's true. That's true. Literally That's not. Honestly, he looks better than Helios, if we're okay, being honest. He also looks like, yesified, and we're not going to... <laughs> Maybe that's what you need. Maybe you need someone to yesify you. No, I... For right now, I just want to focus on the problems at hand, which is those three colossus creatures... The Ghost Lord, which is now four problems, and Kentamane, which is a fifth Which is five problem. problems, actually. Not good math, not it. <laughs> no. So, if, if, Yanni, if the spell is done, right, it's, you know, I think by my count, we, I mean, you know, Ladder has sacrificed three sparks, and so there should be three available, and if we go down and get a fourth And kill the Ghost, Ghost Lord, yeah, we get a fourth yeah. one, yeah. Yeah. Do we and know? while we're down there, we can talk to other Talieos and see if yeah, we free him in exchange for the spark. Do, do we know where these three sparks are? Um, just by like, do you have them in your your newly inherited study or bedroom or something? Shuffle, awkward fate shuffle. <laughs> if I had to guess. I would say, um, well, they're not on us. Really? I I wonder if they're where the tree was. 
<laughs> it's a pretty it's... safe bet that Thylia probably has them. She has them. Thylia has them. Do you think she could just, like, make them appear if, like, we ask for them? Like, I mean, she, since she's kind of everywhere, right? And <clears throat> Guys, don't I don't know if you remember, like, I don't know, like, 15 minutes ago <laughs> when my wings all fell off and turned into blood that was shooting yeah, out of my body scary. because I was talking to Thalia. Yeah. They're back now, so. I don't know if you guys remember that part of this last 30 minutes. Seems uh, like it was weeks ago. <laughs> okay, but, but if she's a god, we don't need to talk to her, like, that way. We we could just pray to her. Does Doesn't don't they hear it, us that way, too? All the gods try. turn in your direction. Nod. Oh. And go back to their own conversations. Okay. So, so, yeah. so all right, here. I'm not doing a prayer circle. I, uh, I'll pray to her. A kumba, yeah. Uh, I'll go, just yeah. appear sometimes. Okay. <laughs> well, Lyra, it should be you. You're the head I fate. kick it off the cliff. Yeah. <laughs> boom, boom, yeah. Boom, boom, boom. It's, well, you know what? The it three of like us, early 2000s. as the fates, maybe we all need to pray together and and talk to her. She sent us on this mission. Yeah. Oh my gosh, are we gonna? What's that movie? Return to Witch Mountain. Is that? Yeah. Is that the reference I'm thinking? Absolutely, of? <laughs> absolutely. But you have to lead the prayer. You are the lead fate. Oh. With great power comes great responsibility. <laughs> that sounds like a terrible idea, actually. I read it in a book once. Lyra, again, you are the best, the most well-spoken in this group, see? <laughs> you were about to say best speaker, were you? Yeah. <laughs> I sure was. I do the speaking really well. Mm -hmm. Um. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Sure. You got right. this. Prayer okay. circle. Right here. Oh, you now? We're, done. We're going now? I, it better, yeah, no I better time to ask than now. Uh, okay. Did you want to wait another day? Or no, we don't Maybe have I time. did. Maybe I did. Let's go, Lyra. I guess we all put our hands together, which is, <laughs> feels really unnecessary. But it probably weird. is. It probably <laughs> is, but... It's okay. This is fate stuff. We are so good being fake. We get to make our own traditions now. So, yeah. But, okay. It's, it's fine. I mean, praying is really just having a one-sided conversation, and I don't know what good this is going to do, but here we go. Ask her to release the sparks when we do the spell. Say, if we do the spell, will you release the sparks to us? You should also say that we promised to to take off, you know, take down Kentamane and Brissa knows. All right, this seems like a lot Brissa, for a do you prayer, want to join but the prayer yeah, actually, why don't we all <laughs> do, do it? Do it. <laughs> Leonard, Yanni, let's do it. Let's, let's do it. All right, let's, and and you know what? Okay. That way, if she's like, I need arguments, Yanni can argue for himself. Brissa can argue it for herself, there and we're go. good. All right, I'm I'm gonna go. Out on a limb here. Once again, reiterating, praying is not having a conversation. There's not going to be a dialogue. It's not a back and forth. Uh, okay. Second, sure. I know we've asked Yanni a lot, but for some reason, deep down, I feel like asking Yanni to pray is maybe crossing the line. Oh, you know what? That is a fair point. Yeah, okay, you're right. I'm Yanni? Sorry. What? Would you want to join our circle of which we are attempting to talk to Thylea you don't have to pray but we're kind of using that as a medium to talk to her and Lyra the gods did say they're here so in theory yeah. you know Thylea will hear right and so she will you know hear us that we're asking for the sparks yeah we could be right. like give us a sign and maybe no, her sign I understand is how praying works it's just not an open dialogue you guys are like you can fend for yourself and ask your questions that's not how praying works there is no back and forth. It's one one thing, and then it's done, and you wait for an answer. Yeah. So, Yanni, do you want to join us? You don't have to. I, 
then I guess I got nothing better to do. It okay. might not even work, honestly. Hey, Circle, let's go! <laughs> or or sit and talk to Thylea, Circle, whatever one makes you feel better. Okay. The, the church's new recruitment motto. Yeah. You got nothing better to do. <laughs> yeah, let's go. It's okay, Lyra, are you going to lead us in our one-sided conversation? I fucking guess so. All right. Isn't that a monologue? Yeah. I think I'd be good at that. <laughs> okay. Um... Hands up, everyone. Yana, you don't have to. No, no, no. If, if, Yana, you have to. It's now a thing. He's Thank not you. praying, though. Yeah, it's, he's not praying. He's just making sure she... He's, it's a thing. It's, it's like when you do right. a seance. You, right. you all have to hold hands and you can't right. let go. Sure. Okay. <laughs> it breaks the circle. Thank you. Okay. Uh... Oh, not so tight. Sorry. I'm so excited. Daphne, your hands are so clammy. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey. Hey, Thylea. Um. Don't know how we ended up here. A lot has happened in the last 30 minutes. Don't know how this was the answer, but here we are. Um, just reaching out, wondering about those three divine sparks I gave you, wondering if maybe it's a possibility that you'll let us use those so that we can ascend, so we can help you kill Kentamane, which we've all agreed to do, even Brissa, even though she was really hesitant at first, but, you know, I won her over, we're best friends, um, and... You know, we just think maybe being on an even playing field will help the outcome be more in our favor rather than just going in blind as mortals that will immediately get smacked down by this hundred-handed uh, god. Um, so, you know, just if you could give us a sign whether or not you'll let us use those, that'd be great. Also, um, love you. Uh... And thank you for this meal we're about to share. Amen. <laughs> I, I feel like I need to do some sort of other symbol, so I'm just gonna do whatever. Do like a tree growing up? <laughs> yeah, a tree. <laughs> also, so ignore the last part. Ignore everything that's happening right now. It's not part of the prayer. Uh, Darian has lost it. I, I need... <laughs> Brissa did the tree thing. <laughs> it's not me. <laughs> Carpathos just looks at you and he's like, see, this is what we need to get rid of gods. Look at this shit. Um, I'm you... going to kill this. <laughs> he can be the sacrifice. As you finish uh, uh, your prayer to Thalia, uh, Daphne, Lyra, Darian, your foreheads itch. Daphne, our foreheads itch? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, so that might be a sign, but it's also not a yes or no. Maybe okay. I should have been more specific. <laughs> Yanni, your green tattoos glow very faintly. Oh. And as Brissa, the, you tuned a little. <laughs> the fates look at each other. And as you do, you see that hovering before your forehead, maybe like a quarter of an inch, is a stylized symbol of a green eye that glows there for a second. <laughs> Oh, and as you touch it, it pff, disappears, Daphne. All right, cool. That's a sign. Okay. <laughs> well, it a okay. positive or a negative? Listen, if she was going to say no, she would have just been quiet. She said yeah. a sign. She is... I'm going to trust that that's our... Hell yeah. Kick his ass. I, okay, I agree. Well, I think it's positive. Yeah. Now I guess we need to decide... Uh, as that happens. Who number three is going to be... Oh, God! Yeah. <laughs> you suddenly feel it's it's weird it's almost like that magnetic pull that you felt before to the ley line except now you feel it to the three fates it's almost like with closing your eyes if you focus enough you can still tell exactly where they are mm -hmm. <clears throat> 
You guys are already like supercharged or something with her energy. I don't know if like you might already be demigods and not even know it or something. Yanni, go ahead and make me an arcana check as part of this. As you suddenly see him get up and start to do a bunch of like testing using different weird formulas in his book and, and kind of messing around with things. 32. They themselves seem to not have changed. Even trying to apply something like a modicum of damage to their skin damages them exactly how it did before. Ow. Don't <laughs> pinch me, Yanni. What the <laughs> fuck? Be glad that's all I did. Science. <laughs> um, but instead, you notice that there is a connection that you seem to be able to feel. The fates don't don't feel anything beyond what they felt before for one another which is a lot. We can't unpack that in a whole session. Probably a whole campaign. Therapy is what the therapy is what you need. Um, but Yanni, <laughs> you feel that connection to them now. The same connection that you felt about the ley lines. As if you can draw something forth from them that you weren't able to before. Hmm. Wait, I might have misinterpreted that. I think she's. She might have stored the sparks in you three. Oh, I, I thought that was just indigestion. <laughs> I mean, you do have such a sensitive system. Anything I mean, that's not bird. You guys keep food. feeding me bird food like that's <laughs> what I eat. Till the end, people, till the end. Lactose intolerant, but I can't say I can't say no to cheese. I'm so sorry. I'm allergic to sunflower seeds. <laughs> Why do you keep eating it? <laughs> you just keep giving them to me. They're just so delicious. It's, it's, I always forget you have bird feet. I always forget that you have bird feet. <laughs> um. So does Careful, that mean? I that... wish that you have bird feet. <laughs> I rock bird feet. Um. I'm... Are we? Su uh, okay, no, wait. You're supposed to be the one that has the answers, so I'm gonna need you to focus up. Am I su supposed to cast a spell on on each of you and complete some kind of deific metamorphosis or something for you? Honestly, your guess is as good as mine. This is why prayers don't work. You only well, get could... one question. No, it's not. We could pray again. <laughs> we could pray again. <laughs> I don't know. She if probably will either. screen our prayer. <laughs> She's probably waiting right now next to the phone. She's going to hang up on our prayer. What's her What's phone? phone? <laughs> <laughs> Do you think it would just be drawn out when you cast the spell, right? Like, you know, like she just put it there for use for, you know. Yeah, like maybe, yeah. maybe we... Uh, Transfer the spark to I, whoever you cast I, the spell on. I want to try to... Uh-oh. Um, connect with with Lyra as she's talking at me. As you try Kind of like I did with the... Yeah, yeah. The third eye flares up of Lyra's head again. And you can see that, uh, indeed, the, the tattoo across your body begins to glow. I want to... Like, super tentatively, not like trying and like just full on yank, but like, I just want to see if I can start to tease out the, a spark, if it's actually there, if I'm reading this right. Oh, DMs of every persuasion I've had to make the, I would just like to tease it out of the other. <laughs> no, it's, not. It, it's more uh, like, it's more like, I'm not even so much trying to pull on it, it's just uh -huh. see if I can get a hold of it. Yeah, you yeah, know? It's, it's hard to grasp sometimes. I get it. It's it's fair. Not a lot of people a... can find it, so. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's true. Why don't you make me a slide of hand check, Yanni? <laughs> uh, just what does this look like? Is Yanni just staring <laughs> at you, Lyra? Could you describe trying to tease it out <laughs> of Lyra? So Yanni has the same, like, genetic problem that I have where when we're concentrating on something, we with the tongue. So he's all like, uh -huh, uh -huh. So like literally physically manifesting tongue with it that's good that's mm -hmm. good that's a good mm -hmm. image mm -hmm. i'm just trying to continue with the whole let's break clancy Yanni, we we just that is, that is this is a weird 180 <laughs> so that's 
so yeah, um, it's it's that whole like, and he's like, yeah, exactly what I'm doing, like squinting, closing one eye, completely squinting the other, it's like kind of prayer does to Yanni. Damn. <laughs> oh my god. As you do, you suddenly feel a connection, like a, like there is a dam of power as you just pull at a little pedal pebble and you get the sense that this entire dam could just turn into fine dust if you yanked hard enough on this. But there's something weird about it. With your 32, I will say that you quickly put a couple things together. It's weird because this is the connection that you felt to the ley line, not necessarily the thing that you felt when you sacrificed the sun god. Or sorry, sky father. This, this, <laughs> this seems to be a different kind of connection. A connection to Thalia herself, to the land, to the goddess. Something that you can unlock. And in fact, you could even leave it open to be used by the three. And in fact, you're pretty sure that if they attune to this power, they can do it too. You heard reports from well, Pascal that apparently there is something weird about these monsters that they fought, particularly the dragons so far. Specifically, what they've been telling you is that they haven't been able to kill the thing outright. Even when it should have died, it was able to come back to life. This is not a spark, per se. This is a connection to Thylea to supercharge whatever you can put your mind to, to maybe strike the felling blow to these three titanic creatures. A means to actually kill them. And as you put this all together, you suddenly feel a figure standing behind you. Nobody else sees this. You don't even see it, but you feel it. A tall woman, olive skin, black hair cascading down. As you turn around to try to look at her, there's a faint smile in what appears to be a vaguely humanoid figure with three eyes. Two in the places that you would imagine, one in the forehead that just blinks out of existence. As you put all of this together, you realize that it, your mind has been changed. The information has been incepted. This was not just you thinking of this but a god literally reaching into your mind and presenting an option. Similarly, you feel, without a shadow of a doubt, that when the sparks are needed, you will be able to access them. Main meanwhile, by the way, everyone else, Yanni's still doing this. Yeah. Uh, you gotta squint okay? that other eye a little more. Is, is he okay? <laughs> don't know. He, don't. He's just is really concentrating. Him? I think praying may have broken him. I, I want it. Yanni, are you, are you pooping? What's going on? <laughs> are you pooping? What's going on? <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. I was misreading it. It's... She's imbued you three with... with power that you can tap into. That's... It's... You can use it, among other things, I think, to, like... Just render things dead that don't die like or at least like the the these monstrosities we have to deal with she made that pretty clear but i got the impression that there's more to it than that even that it, you can you can learn to tap into it so like try some more of that meditation but instead of reaching out reach within and see if you can tap into this somehow. Uh, if, if we can kill things that don't die, uh, do you think it would... 
I, like I said, I don't, she made it pretty like, like she literally spoon fed me what I needed to know. It's crazy. Um, and and she was she made it clear that it would, like how Pascal was saying they they, if they killed these things they just came back. Mm -hmm. She made it clear that you'll have the ability to deliver a, a truly killing blow. I don't know if it'll work. Otherwise, couldn't tell you. Okay, word. Um, but I think you should probably explore somehow your your your. I don't know, minds, souls, spirits. I don't know exactly where it's attached. Our bodies. It helps Our if you stick your tongue out and squint. That's all I know. Did, did she? Did she give you any answer about? The question the, we the asked. Sparks? <laughs> what about the sparks? Yeah. Oh, the, uh, the, they're around when I need them. Oh. I'll, oh. I'll be able to access them to cast the spell. Do we Do we want to do that now? Yeah. Also, I mean, we can start. It takes an hour per casting. Well, we should definitely... And 10,000 I mean, gold. 10,000. Well, we got plenty what? in Metro. Yeah, so. Wow. This weird god from the sky <laughs> just... <laughs> talk money it's <laughs> and it really just made me feel yeah, super cool. I mean, you would you would think you know if 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 she wants us to do this for her benefit she she'd waive the the fee the but apparently not it kind of feels like an mln or mlm <laughs> like you have to buy your way into the pyramid to like buy your way into godhood yeah well it's fine we have a whole treasury in a city like an hour away or whatever, 30 minutes. I don't know how long it takes to get there from here. Yeah. Um, and my people bring all that gold back that, you know, was looted by Moxana as well. There like, is definitely gold in Mitros. It is not super available per se, but you certainly have enough again to cast it. It's going to leave Mitros a little bit destitute from that perspective. Spending ten thousand well, multiple times. But, I, but, 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 but. I just if they all die the anyways, it doesn't matter. Exactly. So you guys, you yeah. guys have access to it. You don't have to worry about it. I shouldn't have. Brissa, my, oh, so, so my people, speaking. my people owe you. I mean, so like, we we will work together to make sure will. that both of our we'll both just of our raise taxes. Prosper. We'll make it back. We'll make it back yeah. in like a year. We'll, we'll, we'll raise taxes. For it is people. not. <laughs> that is not always the like the solution, but you know, like it's you know, we'll we'll figure it out. See, this is one of those things where where like if you let the people help decide their own fate, you know, you wouldn't have to. Absolute nonsense, Yoni. Yeah. I really think that's something that don't know what you're talking about. Still think you might be messed up from the praying. sometimes. I know how smart you are, and then you say the dumbest things like. <laughs> <laughs> Carpathos over there just going mm -hmm. taxation is left. <laughs> the the problem is you have Shut to up. make sure that that when you when you write the the compact that you're all going to follow that you you make sure that the appointed representatives can't <clears throat> give themselves pay raises without the people's approval. That's that and and term limits we need to talk about term limits okay that sounds like a whole lot of nonsense here's my idea everything that you sell in mitros for every gold that it costs you also charge them two silver wow 20 percent. so taxes is, it, is it what you're saying well but like only on goods Oh, okay, okay. But oh, but also, if it's not made in Mitros, like things you're selling, you, like you a sales tax, the tax. things that are coming into Mitros, oh. like double, so people, yeah, so that we produce things locally instead, right, and like stimulate bring our that own economy. economy. No, yeah, yeah. so we make really money. It. <laughs> but like, yeah. it's you just tell them it's trickle down economics, <laughs> <laughs> and they'll eat that shit right up. And also, Ooh. make them pay every. We have months. I don't know how the calendar works here. Make them pay every month just to have the ability to go to a healer. Not for the healing itself, just for the option to go to the healer. Make them pay every month. Mm -hmm. Oh, and chariot taxes? You know, of course. <laughs> Any sort of way to get around, you tax it. 
<laughs> you gotta was, upkeep them dirt roads. <laughs> so the people that own the, the, the chariots yeah. make them pay for the chariots. Make them yeah. pay every month in order to keep the chariots in good condition. Mm-hmm. Makes it, you know, if they damage the roads, right? They have to pay for those roads too and everything, That's right? right? So like, yeah. the, right. the, the farriers <laughs> probably you know, have not plants. You have missed literally nothing. They've just been ragging on oh, capitalism. It's been kind of fun. Yeah. Um, but, <laughs> You know, for the record, you know, there was a beautiful beautiful system beforehand where people just <laughs> oathed each other and it worked fine. And then oh, no, we got that and then shit for out. A second crash the system. Out. Part of me, the the politics nerd was me was like, oh my god, do I want to make that a story beat? I'm like, nah, <clears throat> that happened. <laughs> that happened behind the scenes. And mm. now we're inventing Reaganomics. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So, Daphne, and now that so you're back with us. Money. Basically, <laughs> yeah, long story sorry. short, sorry, we can spend the gold. We can spend I, the gold. Listen, okay. Daphne, I don't know why you keep trying to pretend like you don't have this little bunny just with you at all times. <laughs> okay. Um, My soft side, we? okay? <laughs> yeah. Um, so, do you need, like, all of us to do, like, another prayer circle when you do this spell to turn someone into a god? So like, prayer circle. <laughs> Look, here's we did it one time, Daphne. <laughs> and I'm already done. <laughs> here's here's what I'm thinking, because it takes an hour for Yanni to cast the spell. And we already know the first two people that he's going to use it on. So what if we let Yanni cast the spell on or Brissa, either one, they can draw straws, and while that's happening, we can do our our little trio prayer circle to try and figure out whatever this weird um, uh, undead immortal killing power that we supposedly have is. And then while we're doing that, we can figure out which one of us is going to get the third spark. Hephaestus weakly puts one of his three remaining, or sorry, five remaining arms up and is like, um, there's another thing you kind of want to consider. Um, well, you will need Effie, to I don't know if I can deal with this right now. He kind of just cocks his eye at you. Shut up. Oh. You need temples. Really right? If you are to be gods, you need temples, okay? Oh, that's a fair point, actually. Do- do we need it beforehand or afterwards? Uh, I mean, you can ascend first. Just uh, resurrection pretty, magic pretty soon. won't work on you the same way after you die. Uh, you will so just temple automatically. Should be-